Hi, this is Joe from Earthquaker Devices, and I'm here at Winter NAM 2015 in sunny Anaheim, California. And we're going to take you through a few of our latest offerings we're really excited about. So the first one that we have up is we have our Park Fuzz. And the coolest thing about the Park Fuzz is that it's a recreation of the classic Park Fuzz that was made in the 70s. Uh, but we made it a little bit more versatile. Let me give you just a little demonstration of its sound here. Nice and full, rich sustain. Take down the fuzz so you can hear it a little bit more drawn back. Nice and warm. Tone control goes from bass to the right, treble to the left for thinner sounds. Let me give you the old fuzz control again, up. Really a nice linear fuzz, sounds great. Runs at a higher voltage internally, and there's also a lot lower noise than the original. Another one we're really pumped about is our Fuzzmaster General. And this one's a pure octave fuzz, but what we decided to do is give you a few more options. You have your basic tone, level, and fuzz controls, tone being uh, bassier to the right, brighter and uh, treblier to the left. What we're going to do is we're going to start with the germanium switch, and then we also have silicon and then also no diodes, which gives you a sweet ring mod sound, but we'll start with germanium. grainy sound and we'll go over to the silicon gives you a little bit more of a bite on top you get more attack back and the nice octave up now we're gonna go with what I think is the best setting on the thing and that's kind of our ring mod setting I run the gain a little bit lower on the fuzz control just so you can hear what that sounds like great with chords cool sounded pedal. Uh, now for the other two that we're releasing is they're just repackages of classic EQD effects. So we redid our Hummingbird which is our tremolo. We also did our C machine which is kind of our modulation machine. I'm going to start real quick with the C machine and just give you a basic sound. You can notice that we added a miniature LED to display the rate control no matter if the pedal is on or off. And here's just a basic kind of chorus modulation. All the controls are the same as the original, just a smaller footprint. Let me give you a little bit more of a wild modulation sound using the dimension and animate controls. Kind of spread out the LFO and the delay chain. Really warbly. And then even more extreme and wild, we'll take the shape into more of a square wave pattern. really out there. Hummingbird, really excited about this one. We added an expression pedal input on the right here that you can control the actual rate control. So let me give you just a quick little demonstration of that. Crank up the depth so you can hear it a little bit better. It's hard to hear in NAM here. We also made it a little bit more versatile as far as speed. You have three modes of speed. You got the slowest being over here, and this, this bad boy goes slow. There's our speed, then we'll go up to the maximum setting at the fastest. Almost like time stretching. And also, to top it all off, you can take the depth down, and then you've just got a really, really awesome clean boost. We're 
really hoping that everybody enjoys them. We're really proud of the four products and I think you're gonna love them. Enjoy NAM everybody, have a good day.